Coronavirus. 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 To rely on evidence-informed, credible sources of information when you're looking for updates. The internet disseminates nervousness very well. It takes unverified information and spreads it around the world faster than it can be corrected or put into context. Because the internet is that much bigger than it was 17 years ago, there will be commented upon by historians a certain irony that you can have the entire accumulated knowledge of human civilization in the palm of your hand, and so much of it is flat out wrong. And that's what we're seeing around this hysteria. Those Remarkable shots of that Chinese hospital being built in a matter of days. These videos online are being purported by some to show the digging of mass graves meant to contain those killed by the coronavirus. Obviously very wrong. The fear for many Chinese Canadians of a racist backlash. And many in the community say it is all being fueled by the misinformation circulating online. Some members of the UK's Chinese community say they've witnessed the rise in racist behaviour recently that's coincided with the spread of this outbreak. Chinese Australians are being targeted. Discrimination relating to the coronavirus is fueling an increase in reports of abuse. I guess it's really hurtful because um, a lot of Chinese families have been here for a long time, for generations, right? And truthfully, um, I think our risk of get catching this coronavirus is the same as everybody else. Search social media these days and you'll find plenty of this. Unverified video showing people in China apparently falling to the ground stricken with the coronavirus. There is like, okay, how is it possible I have, I have that? Because I, I wasn't even there. I, I didn't even go there. How, how, how can I get, have the coronavirus if I didn't go there? You must have come in contact with somebody with the coronavirus. This virus is airborne, so you can't get it when you're five to ten feet within somebody. Coronavirus. <laughs> Unfortunately, your PCR test came back positive for the Wuhan coronavirus. Positive for what? The coronavirus. <laughs> This video, posted on a Toronto social media site, shows James Potok being escorted off a plane while being jeered by passengers. Oh, they got you on camera too. You're a clown, man. I said, I just returned from a flight from Hunan province. Um, I might have said, this is the capital for coronavirus. And then I said, I don't feel too well. I am extremely sorry. Um, I'm completely remorseful to everybody that I... I I damaged their plans.